Hey everyone, welcome back to the Red Cat University and the Gen 8 Scout 2 is back on the workbench. Now this particular truck has had a lot of option parts installed underneath the body. It's time to focus on some of the exterior options that Red Cat has to offer. Today we're going to install the aluminum grille and the aluminum wheel option. This will certainly change up the look of the rig. Now let's get to work and get these parts installed. First up, we're going to install the grill. Now this new aluminum grill has a nice satin finish to it and will certainly pop on the front of this orange scout. Now swapping this out is very simple. All you need to do is flip over the body and unscrew the three screws in the headlights that retain the front grill. Use a 1.5 millimeter hex driver to take these screws out. Once the six headlight screws are removed, remove the final screw in the center of the grill and carefully pop the stock grill out of the body. Now we'll need to transfer our headlight lenses to the new grill. And now we can reinstall our new aluminum grill. Push it into the body. Reinstall the center screw and then use the six machine screws that came with the grill kit to secure the headlights. Now, let's swap out those wheels. Start by removing the center cap from the wheel, followed by the wheel nut, using a seven millimeter nut driver or box wrench. Now we need to remove the tire from the wheel. Use a 1.5 millimeter hex driver to remove the beadlock screws from both sides. This is going to take a while. With all of the screws removed from the beadlock ring, remove the rings and push the wheel out of the tire. Now's a great time to check the tire to make sure there's no debris inside. Clean it out if necessary. And now we can mount our tire to the new aluminum wheel. Take the wheel and push it inside the tire and pull the bead over the front. Once the wheel's inside the tire, push it towards the front just a little bit and then seat the tire bead into the wheel. Once the tire bead is in place, take your new outside ring and place it over the wheel. Make sure the holes line up and install the new screws into the wheels. Tighten the screws snugly to begin with, followed by firmly tightening them in a star pattern. Once the front beadlock ring is set in place, turn the tire over and repeat the process for the rear. With the wheel back together, now we can reinstall it on the truck and repeat the process for the rest of the wheels. The new aluminum wheels and grill look great on this rig. Links to the products used in today's video will be listed in the description below. While you're there, please hit that subscribe button and of course we'll see you back soon for another Red Cat Racing how-to video.